Okay, yeah, Simon. Um, Eric, congratulations on the win. Could you, could you just tell us what your thoughts were on Casemiro's red card? <laughs> so, let's start. Oh, we, we played a good game. <laughs> and uh, and for, say congratulations on I know, I know, Simon, you did. Hey? But I think we played a brilliant game. Uh, it was a really uh, high level, first 70 minutes, uh, till that incident um, take place. And then, yeah, you see this team stands for each other. Hey? There's so, such a good spirit in the team. And they, they don't accept when a player from us uh, can be badly injured. And that is the way um, Anthony got treated. And um, then this, this team sticks together. But of course, uh, you have to uh, control your emotions. Uh, but it's really difficult in such a moment. And then I see two teams fighting each other. Uh, I see two teams where players, several players crossing the line. And then one player uh, is picked out and get sent off and for me that's not right. Is it, is it from what you said about Anthony, is it fair to say that you think action should have been taken over that tackle if you think he could have been badly injured? He, the, the player from Crystal Palace takes a big risk by this, by this fall, that he get bad, badly injured by pushing him across the line and, and you know the pitch is here uh, and then, yeah, then everyone is reacting. Crystal Palace players and Man United players, and not only Casimiro. Did, did you think Ayu could should have been sent off to the <laughs> and Rams? Yeah, and yeah. but I, that's well, you bring it up. Huh? But there was one of the players he did uh, even worse, I would say, as Casimiro. Casimiro, you freeze the moment. I think really short. He's crossing the line there. But yeah, the Ayu uh, definitely, uh, and you have to be consistent as a VR. If um, uh, last week we missed Christian Eriksen by bad fall, no interfering from VR. Uh, in Crystal Palace, Mateta is elbowing Martinez. He's running with two weeks with such an eye on his, um, on his um, eyebrow and not interfering. Uh, so yeah, I see uh, this is not right. And uh, this is in the game, uh, the influence on the game, but also for coming games. Does that make you, you happier that you've got through that game, say you defended really well ah. and won the game? Yeah, definitely. Uh, but you see uh, in this moment uh, um, and uh, that there's the team spirit. And so I then also, uh, uh, and once again, they have to control the emotions uh, and you can't cross lines. Uh, there is uh, certain standards also you have to keep there as a team. Uh, but also, yeah, you have to protect each other uh, when yeah, players like Christian Eriksen just uh, last week get such, uh, uh, yeah, it's not co uh, really as a colleague that you want to uh, get another player such an injury, so to bring an injury so to a player. And it was the same with Anthony today. So then you have to stand as a team and that is what they did. But still, once again, you have to keep yourself in control uh, because we are uh, we are role mo models. James. Hi, Eric. Um, how significant is it that you're now without, um, uh, without Casemiro for three games? You've obviously lost Christian Eriksen as well. That pretty much is the heart of your midfield. But it's why you guys have so good this season. Ah, first of all, we have to deal with it. Uh, and we will do. But it's not right. Uh, it shouldn't have happened. Um, and uh, yeah, last week they had the tackle that can uh, there's no refereeing of uh, VR can do <laughs> in first line uh, happen of uh, can do anything about this but this could be was avoidable and because in this incident you have to be consequent and they are inconsistent and and that's not right and so that is not fair um, against us. Matches, you know. uh, we have to think about it, but also uh, oh, be fair. Uh, we have seen, but when you're freezing, uh, then Casemiro uh, is uh, across uh, crossing the line. But uh, as I say, many more players uh, we are crossing the line there. So they linked in a way. Would you say what happened to Christian last week? The reaction of the players this week. Is it, do, you, do you see a link between those two things? No, no. 
No, but it's more the point eh, um, when when everything is so. It's about consistency. Eh, in, um, um, you, but you don't want to lose, obviously, eh, uh, players and that colleagues are hurting each other uh, that bad like the player last week did against uh, Christian Eriksen and the player from Crystal Palace he started this uh, he took uh, uh, a big risk uh, by injury bringing an injury to Anthony uh, Last two, Ian and James uh, Eric, is it fair to say obviously you, you call for control but is it fair to say you're pleased to see your players stand up for each other in that way? I know you don't want to see players sent off but are you happy that Casemiro would react in that way? Yes, and um, we uh, we get um, uh, also some some warnings about uh, that our team uh, reacting like this. And I think you have to do it. You have to protect each other. But as I said, uh, we want to keep uh, f- standards and values. And uh, in Man United, uh, we have to keep them high. We will be. Um, uh, 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 we have to. We can't cross lines. Uh, but we have to stick together. And yes, we we, uh, we have to stand for each other. Yes. Eric, when you said um, with the IU incident when he grabbed Fred by the throat, you said that was even worse than Casemiro. Is that because there was force with IU that he he thrust his hand around? Uh, uh, Casemiro is protecting his um, uh, our player and also protecting the player who, um, who wants to attack. Uh, uh, he holding him back, so he was protecting him. He doesn't want to uh, to hurt the player. Uh, but you think with Ayu, it was clearly a grab to the throat. You say you say it. <laughs> yeah. But my interpretation is the same. But yeah. you see you see but the same things. But your view. I mean, you've been honest enough to say that Casemiro crossed the line. Yeah. If Casemiro is sent off for that incident, do you believe Jordan Ayu should have been sent off? Um, uh, well, that's what we are talking about. I say when Casemiro was sent off for this incident, many more players in that incident had to send off. Then you have to be consequent. So I should have been sent off as well. Definitely. Thank you very much.